Hi everyone, how are you doing today? Today I want to show you how to make a Ferrari. If you look for recipes, they can be different specs. Some calls for a white vermouth and amaretto and others calls for equal measures of Fernet Branca and Campari. Since I am not that much of a fan of the overly bitter cocktails, I will stuck to the version with vermouth and amaretto and I think it's also the older version. So, let's not waste more time and start with the drink. We're gonna add some ice for our glass. And to that we're gonna add ounce and a half or 45 ml of our white vermouth. followed by 15 ml or half an ounce of amaretto. Okay, I'm always struggling to close this bottle. And let's mix it. I will just give it a taste. All right. It's um, it's sweet. You have those uh, notes from the vermouth and the um, kind of slightly bitter almondish notes from the amaretto. So I really like how it is right now. However, some recipes calls also the for the addition of some angostura. I think it is better without since I think that will overwhelm the cocktail, but let's check. And we also need to drop a lemon. So let's see how it is now. Yeah, it's a totally different drink. And um, as I expected, the bitters kind of overpowered everything else. So for me, don't add bitters or if you want you can maybe add some either lemon or orange bitters but just using the vermouth and the amaretto will be enough to give you nice low ABV but uh, somehow fruity and refreshing drink so once again if you ask for my opinion I will stay away um, with the bitters for this particular drink and that is how we make the Ferrari and I have to say that with my current salary, that's the closest I will get to a Ferrari at this point. So cheers everyone and I see you next time. Bye bye.